Hi everyone, Giuliano here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can deliver high quality speech in Microsoft Teams, Zoom or WebEx, for example, by using our teleprompter. A teleprompter is a display device that prompts visual text of a script or speech. We will see two methods, totally free. We will see how you can set up a teleprompter by using a smartphone and in the second one we will set up a virtual teleprompter by using Microsoft Word. Ok, let's check it out together. Here I am on my PC and I am ready to build my virtual teleprompter with Microsoft Word. I already created here a Word document, let's open it. And here I have my Word document open. I have to run a webinar in Microsoft Teams. So in order to bring to the next level my speech, I will use a virtual teleprompter and I will build my script with Microsoft Word. Here I have the content that I will read during my webinar. There are several aspects that you have to keep in mind. In order to read the content easily, you have to choose the right font. In this case, I selected this one, Sequoia UI Black and 14 as sites. Then another important aspect is to have the background black and the text white, so it's definitely more readable. Ok, let's start to modify the text color, so then I will select all my text in the document and then I will change the color in white. Here on top in the search bar you can search for page color. And there we go, I have this item, so I can change now the page color and I will select black. I have now background black and text white, so this is definitely readable. Next, I need to set the auto scroll. This feature is available in Word but doesn't work very well. In fact, I will use Adobe PDF Reader with auto scrolling, which works definitely better. In fact, you can set the auto scroll in Adobe PDF Reader and then you can move your mouse outside of the PDF area so you can interact with other applications and the PDF will still go forward with the auto scrolling. Ok, I will convert now this document in PDF. In order to convert a word in PDF, you have just to click on File and then on Save As. And in the drop down where there is the extension, you can change the extension in PDF. Then save. I will confirm with yes. And now this document is saved on my desktop. Here we go. Let me open now this PDF. And there we go. This is my PDF file here, my content. And now I will reduce down this PDF. I have the camera at the bottom of my screen, so I have to place this virtual teleprompter very near next to my camera. So the, the audience will have the feeling that I will focus directly in the camera during the webinar. Now what I can do here is click on view and then in page display there is the option automatically scroll. You can even use this combination by typing shift plus control plus H. Okay, let me set now auto scrolling now this is very cool because I can click outside of my PDF and as you can see the teleprompter will still go forward. Ok, let me just open Teams now that I have here. I can reduce and change the size of this window. I will have my webinar here and then here I have this virtual teleprompter next to my camera. Ok, we have not done. I want to show you how it works this auto scrolling. If you want you can change the speed by typing the number 3 or 4 or 2 or 1. So you can configure the speed that you prefer. In my case I will select 2. Ok, so then I will type shift Control h to stop this auto scrolling. All set up now, I can start this Teams meeting and I can start to use my teleprompter. I am ready now to deliver my webinar, but before to do it, let me resize a little bit this PDF in order to stay very closer to the camera. Okay, I am ready now. So we can we can start. I will click now on the Meet button in Microsoft Teams, so I will join this meeting. Hello everyone! Then I will turn off my microphone just to avoid disturbs because I am recording right now. And then 
Let's join this meeting. I am now in the webinar and I am ready. Let me start the teleprompter by typing Ctrl Shift H. Thank you for joining this webinar. Let's see in the session how to cook the best pizza ever. I show you every step. All pizza doughs start with the same basic ingredients, flour, yeast, water, oil, and olive oil. Here, the breakdown. So as you can see, I'm reading, but the audience has the perspective, has the feeling that I am watching on the camera. So this is very, very cool. Now I'll show you another method that you have. I am now on my Android device. I installed an app called Elegant Teleprompter, which is totally free. This app allows you to use your smartphone as a teleprompter, so you can put it easily next to your camera. I created a content here, lecture one. Let me tap on it. There is the ADS, let me close. And now I can tap on the button play. The content start to appear and I can decide if I want to increase the speed of the text or I can decrease the speed. Okay, we have seen in this quick video how you can set up a teleprompter in order to bring to the next level your speech. If you enjoyed the video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to stay tuned with my next videos. Put a comment down below if you want to see me cover any other topics in the future. This is exactly how I build my to-do list for my next videos. I hope to see you next time. Bye!